In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can adjust the software update option for your Garmin Forerunner 955 watch. Now, first, let me say I'm going to show you how to do this on the watch. We could also do this in the Garmin Connect app on our cell phone and then simply sync the watch to the app and that will make this change for us. Now, by default, when you get your watch, the software update is going to be set to automatic. And what that means is anytime Garmin pushes out an update, it will let you know on your watch and it will automatically update it on your watch. But you don't have to do that. If you'd rather just do updates manually, you could totally do that. Most people who do the manual option are probably going to be using Garmin Express on their computer versus using Garmin Connect with their cell phone. It's pretty easy to change the setting. We're going to press and hold the middle button on the left hand side. That'll take us to our menu. Then once we're in menu, you could either use the up or down button. In this case, it makes more sense to simply press up because you need to go to system. We're going to press the upper right button to choose system. Now I'm using the buttons. We could use touchscreen because this is a touchscreen enabled watch as well. Under system, again, we can use the up or down button. We're going to use the up button and we're going to go to software update. Simply press the upper right button to select it. You can see again, the default is auto update, but if you don't want that, you can simply press the upper right button and now you've turned off the auto update feature. The reason I like turning it off is sometimes when your watch runs an update, if you're using your cell phone, it can really drain the battery. So I kind of prefer not doing updates. And then every now and then when I need to charge my watch, I just plug it into my computer, open Garmin Express, and then see if there's an update and get it that way. But again, that's a personal preference. Once you're done, you can simply press the back button a couple of times, or you could always press and hold the middle button on the left hand side. That will always take you back to your watch face. I hope the video helps.